I may or may not have just spilt a drink all over my keyboard and now I have to hope it dries. I wiped off the WASD letters by trying to clean it. That's how my day's going. But regardless of that, today I'm going to be living the life and career of Zendaya. And we are going to be doing both acting and pop star. So we're gonna release a bunch of music that she's released and act, but unfortunately we can't really control the acting gigs we get in Bit Life as we can't choose the names and stuff. If we can come across something like Greatest Showman or Spider-Man or something like Euphoria in it, we'll definitely do it. But basically the goal is to become a successful actor. Today's post notification shout out goes to ash parker if you guys ever want to shout out all you have to do is subscribe turn on post notifications comment down down below and yeah with that being said let's get into it so i'm gonna read out the criteria for all of you really quick i'm gonna have it down below in the comments so we have to be born a female in oakland california united states i didn't check if oakland is in the game but i'll check if not i'll just figure it out. You guys all told me that it's actually better to do vocal lessons since increasing your vocals is very hard in the game. We're doing singing as our special talent that'll be easier and it gives us time to boost our acting just in case and so we're gonna do some of the music she's released and then after that we're gonna begin our acting career because in bit life you can't do both simultaneously at the same time. We know she did that in real life like Greatest Showman is literally both acting and singing. Euphoria she acts and sings. Shake it up you know like even just going as far back in the day as possible she's always done both but we can only do one at a time so and then that's pretty much it we're gonna date our co-star we're gonna name him tom holland and that'll be the end of it okay so here we have zendaya they did oh <laughs> they did have oakland in the game so we're good and my parents are both 17 <laughs> so that's that's very interesting so we have mason and addison as our parents okay so we're old enough now to hopefully our parents allow us to do acting and singing acting is more important she refused i'm gonna literally have to start a new life why is it my mother why can't like my father agree like why oh <gasps> You're joking, we're gonna age. Okay, I literally have to start a new life. I, uh, should I just start over? Maybe like think what I'm gonna have to do is like change my mom's attributes to make her more lenient so that she'll say yes. Okay, so let me, yeah, let's do it now. Edit attributes, generosity will go high, willpower low, um, craziness will go low. I'll change my dad too, <laughs> just in case. Generosity high, craziness low, willpower low. Hopefully now they let me, if not, I literally have to make a new Zendaya life. Okay, she agreed. Awesome. And now she also needs to let me in vocal lesson. Ooh, I saved this. I saved this life. Thank goodness. Okay, so we're still in elementary school, so let's just work on our lessons now. But I had my special talent is music, so acting is like way easier apparently. Yeah, it is. It's way easier to do well in acting without it as a special talent compared to vocals. Like vocals, even with special talent, is hard to get a full bar sometimes. <laughs> a friend who lives nearby you tells you that he knows of an abandoned building across town where there's a dead body. How does he know where that is? It's as if he put it there um stay home thank you okay we're in middle school hopefully there's drama club yes there is there is and is there like a choir or glee club doesn't matter we got the drama club to help us with our acting gonna do our acting lessons thank goodness i changed my parents attributes because when i tell you when it got rejected the first time my stomach dropped i was like this video is flashing before my eyes. It is over before it even begun. Run away from my first kiss. We're almost at a full bar already. In the Selena Gomez video I did, I struggled so hard because I made acting my special talent and then vocals I had to try. It took me like 40 years to get the vocal bar full. So your girl messed up. Vice president of the drama club. Okay, drama club we're gonna join again in high school. Again, I'm gonna look for a glee club or something. Um, Concert band, that could work. Let's go with that. Join like concert, band, glee club, choir. Any of those probably help. Treasurer of the drama club. Okay, time to take our driver's license. Speaking of driver's license, Olivia Rodrigo's new song came out and I cannot stop listening to it. It is so good. Okay, we'll ask for a more expensive car. Sell for 23,000, thank you. We're about to graduate, but if you look, my acting lesson bar is full and vocals is basically there. My father has divorced my stepmother. <laughs> Take some time off. That was a surprise. Um, I'll just try one more time for voice lessons. It's just gonna stay right there and tease me. I'm not gonna give in though. I'm not gonna get into it. Okay, so what did I say? We have to do vocals first. And I think we're gonna go for pop. Country. 
No, thank you. So the other company offered me a country and we're not going for that. So we're just gonna try Atlas Records. <laughs> First try. <laughs> Thank you, Atlas Records. Sign the contract. Okay, so now we have to change our name to a single name Zendaya because she always said that it just sounds better when it's a one named name. So stage name is going to be Zendaya. And if only we could do that as well for acting. I can't remember if we can, but if not, it's fine. But at least for pop, we're gonna do it. Gotta make sure we practice in our skills. And I always make this as a reminder in every pop or career video I do. So when I am recreating pop star careers and stuff, I only ever do the singles that they were like a lead on. So even if there are other ones, I only ever do those. And then albums, maybe an EP if they didn't have albums, you know, so that's kind of the general idea with this. So that being said, we're gonna do our first single, Swag It Out. And we're just gonna go with Bubblegum Pop because that one usually does well. It was a moderate success, I'll take it. I need at least one diamond though in this video, Zendaya, please. So we have a song now, so let's do some concerts. Oakland, United States, a home show, do it. Okay, while well, beautifully performing one of your iconic singles at a winter music festival, aka our only single, you suddenly realize that one of your backup dancers is singing your notes in an attempt to outstyle you. Sing a duet. <laughs> I'm famous. And now we have the iconic shake it up song. Watch me. Moderate success, please. I'm so disappointed. But regardless, we can go on a world tour, <laughs> practice our skills, and I'm gonna do a couple concerts, you know, get us some money. Okay, we're renewing our contract. So we get 100,000 in advance and a royalty rate of 20%. That's really high. Gotta get that popularity up. Okay, so our popularity is at 96%, so that's really good. I'll do a concert or two. Get it up to 100, good. So the next single is something to dance for. All you guys that grew up watching Shake It Up and stuff, you already know. Something to dance for. Bronze statue. Your manager has set up an 8 a.m. interview with a DJ of Radio Kiss to promote something to dance for. Be a professional. Moderate success, this is unfair. This is cool. Zendaya deserves better. So the fourth single on our list for Zendaya is Fashion Is My Kryptonite. And we're gonna go with a marble statue. I know we literally just did a bronze one, but it's marble. I'm gonna cry. <sighs> At least watch me win gold. Okay, and fashion is my kryptonite win gold. Okay, we're back with the happiness. Finally have a self-titled album called Zendaya. It has 11 tracks and our lead track is gonna be the song Butterflies. Success, okay, at least we have something else that's different than moderate success because we've literally gotten moderate success for everything. Um, at least it's a success and it went gold. So the next single we have is Contagious Love. I am manifesting platinum. If I can't get diamond, platinum, please. Zendaya deserves this. First one going gold right away. <laughs> We're finally making progress. I love though, like trying to switch between pop star and acting. I want to do a video where I try to have every every career in one life, which I don't think would be possible, but I could do every job pack in one life. That's something I want to try. Bouncing between everything and like seeing if there's a way to make it so that you could literally do everything. Let me know if you'd want to see that because that's something I'm thinking about. But regardless, next is my favorite song from her. I'm sure it's a favorite of many of you guys watching, but Replay, it's just so good. So catchy. The dancing in it was great. Okay, it went gold. Good. Does it deserve more? Yes. But we got to be pretty happy. Oh, I already went on a tour. Oops. But we do got to be pretty happy selling 500,000 copies. Like, what are we complaining about? A music festival. 600,000 people, that's a big deal. Can you imagine a crowd that big? The panic. <laughs> Another one. Now we have our single, My Baby. And this one is dedicated to Mr. Tom Holland. <laughs> I just wish that BitLife updates the actor pack and I hope they don't make it an expansion pack. Like they should have, they should do an update for the job pack to make it so that you can be a director or something and have the choice to make your own movies, not just star in them. I wanted to do more with the actor pack because it was like, I wanted to be Leonardo DiCaprio and act in all the movies he acted in and be able to change my character name to like Jack Dawson and have a co-star and change her to Rose. I really want wanted to be able to do that and I feel like a lot of you guys wanted to be able to do that as well like being a director hiring actors not even participating in the movie at all just being the director right so it's unfortunate and I really hope that they do like a revamp of like pop singer and stuff so that would be cool I really hope they just like update those and don't like turn them into expansion packs because that would suck but that's just a little thought from me now we have something new Old. Okay, sing along pop, we love. Now we have Rewrite the Stars, literally one of my favorite songs. The Greatest Showman was such a good movie. The musical, oh my God, the music, like don't even get me started about the song, This Is Me. So beautiful, it literally makes me cry. It seems 
Spitlife thinks Zendaya is a gold girl. I want her to be a diamond girl. We have All For Us and then Elliot's song. I wish she came out with more music, but I do love that she sings in like movies. So that like makes up for it, you know? This is a success. I'm sad. Why isn't anything going platinum? <laughs> now all we have left is Elliot's song. <laughs> oh my god. Period. So now we have to quit our oh we have to walk out on our contract they're gonna be mad at me but i don't care and now we have to start our acting career let me double check what our skill is at because i i kind of neglected it okay okay <laughs> i just took one more and it went back so we have to start our acting career look for a talent agent please i'm famous <laughs> No, it's a bad reputation. Ooh, Raven Simone. They have 35 years of experience. Commission is 12%, but the reputation will be a little higher. Am I being like too picky? I am. <laughs> Yikes. I'll just I'll just do extra work and try again next year. You discovered the opportunity to work as an extra on set of the upcoming film No More Glass Slippers. Maybe because I'm a famous pop star, this will like get me noticed. Take the opportunity. It didn't. Oh, bad reputation. What, what is this look? Okay, this is better. Mitch Kirk has offered to represent you. He has the best reputation. He doesn't have as much experience though and his commission's a little lower, but he has a good reputation. I'll just hire him. Just help me out, sir. Okay, oh my God, I asked him out. <laughs> I really hope I can find a bit like parody version of like Greatest Showman, Shake It Up, Foria, you know? That's what I'm really hoping for. But let's see what television shows there are. Okay, nothing about like Euphoria. The most important thing at the end of the day would be just having a successful career. So let's try for a movie. Let's go Chucky the Umpire Slayer. <laughs> oh, my fit isn't good. I'll still try. I'll be a 70 year old. <laughs> I didn't get it, but I tried. The Brotherhood of Spaghetti, please. We got it, okay. I'm gonna be Diana Williamson, a lead character. PG-13, a million dollar budget. Negotiate, okay. So I've become an actor. They want me to touch a donkey. Of course I would. Who doesn't want to touch a donkey? Famous actor, hello. The movie Brotherhood of Spaghetti was a success. Critics called the film a reminder of the strength of human spirit. Okay, that's not bad. We only got 66,000 for all that work. Please, we literally had to touch a donkey. Ready, set, boom, The Great Gatsby. Close, The Greatest Showman. That's what I thought I was gonna say. TV roles, L Lucy McGuire. Regular, it's been running for nine years. I'm a good fit. Why don't we try? <gasps> Okay, 180,000 an episode, 18 episodes. We can negotiate probably. 230, I'll take it for now. It, the show might get canceled for all we know. Okay, so our role is Autumn Cox. It's a drama and we have to dye our hair. Okay, we'll see how this goes. We have to eat caviar happily. That bite is probably gonna be like $50,000. <laughs> Comment down below, have any of y'all ever had caviar? I've never. As part of your work on expecting Morning Glory TV is requiring you to wrestle your co-star Tanner in pudding in a scene happily okay so our show has aired and we made 3.5 million that is not bad at all and it won a biddy award for best drama show critical reception was high it was renewed zendaya is thriving oh i didn't check if we can change her name to like a one named person for acting let's see you should be able in the actor career to be able to do multiple gigs at once because there are plenty of people who are filming a tv show and movie at the same time people that come out with multiple things a year you know same with music you should be able to release like more than one song a year or you should at least be able to release one album and one song oh i have been nominated for a biddy award for best supporting actress for my portrayal of autumn cox and expecting i'm invited to attend let's go i won i won huh. as zendaya should oh acceptance speech okay you've been invited on stage to accept your biddy award for best supporting actress what kind of speech will you deliver <laughs> gratitude keep it short and sweet and no smugness okay my castmates stood up and clapped and it was renewed, good. Canceled, it was going so well. Oh, my agent secured me an audition for lead role in the sitcom television show, Sex in the Town. Oh, I'd be the lead. Cherry Bradshaw, that's very tempting. But I really, I'm in a pass. I really wanna see if there is anything like Spider-Man or something, especially cause our fame is literally like a full bar and our reputation for the other show was full as well. So let's see movies. Here, there, everywhere. Here, there, everywhere. 46 year old female. The budget is only 900,000. Oh, action film, 
majority report. Angela Lively supporting role. $17 million budget. I got it. I got it. Okay, we're gonna negotiate. Hopefully we get a royalty from the movie. No, I didn't. Oh yes, I got a bonus. 1.5%. Let's negotiate one more time. Still 1.5. That's fine. 2.6 million compensation. 1.5. Let's hope. The movie does well, so we get a big payout. It was a commercial success. It made 105 million in the box office. Okay, box office bonus was 1.5 mil. Agent took 400,000, that kind of hurts, but we did good. Oh, a Silver Globe nomination. So we won a bitty award for Best Supporting Actress. So now this is gonna be our Silver Globe. So attend in person, Oh. Dang it, act gracious. Okay, I'm gonna fire my agent because we have a really bad relationship. So I'm gonna look for a new one. Oh, no, no. The famous client is Zendaya, AKA me. When worlds collide, we gotta hire him now. Mihail Novak, you, you and me are together now for life. I'm not firing you no matter how bad it gets. We are literally living in the multiverse. Listen, I know Zendaya didn't act in this, but it doesn't matter. We have to just do what the bit life gods tell us to do. And they're telling me to audition for Lord of the Strings because do you see that budget? Reject, no, I, I deserve better. Field of Screams. Thriller. Cindy should be in a thriller. Oh. <laughs> oh gosh, I know logically that doing TV shows and stuff is better for like money-wise and career-wise, but I'm trying to find Spider-Man. I have been looking for the Spider-Man movie and I have finally found the arachnid man and now i can finally find my tom holland okay it took so long arachnid man i'm june parker budget is 161 million i got it 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 okay <gasps> okay compensation is 11 million okay we're june parker we're gonna negotiate 19 mil hopefully we get some box office stuff i need some royalties we got it 1.5 percent i'm gonna negotiate once more i'm good with that 20 mil 1.5 percent except i'm so happy finally got spider-man okay um while well, filming arachnid man <laughs> you notice Tom Hardy, Tom Holland, it's fate. It's also filming a movie at the same studio. You want to see him in action, but visiting sets is prohibited. We'll watch from a distance. Okay, uh, that brought down my reputation. Oops. Okay, we have to find our co-star. Um, Young Pound. He is the lead role. Let's rehearse with him. Wait, how old is he? 22. I mean, <laughs> he's kind of young. Let's befriend him. Doesn't want to be my friend. Is it because you want to be my lover? A glitter bomb. Bouquet of flowers. He hates me. A deodorant stick. A Chromebook laptop. Electric razor. Okay. Okay. Our relationship is better. Okay. He likes me now. I am going to change his attributes though. Um, uh, be my friend. Wow. Tom Holland. Nice to meet you. Okay. So now we're going to completely change him so that he resembles Tom Holland. And then hopefully we can ask him out. I know the age is different, but we're not worried about that. Okay. Timothy. Timothy. <laughs> Holland. Tom Holland has right now. I'm going for, hopefully they have something similar. I mean, they don't really have any hair that's similar to Tom Holland's right now. I'll just go with this. This is like the Spider-Man vibe. And I think Tom Holland has, what eye color does he have? Yeah, I think they're brown. So that's our boy Tom. Now we have to ask him out. No way, that worked. That actually worked. That worked. His net worth is 96.9 million. <laughs> oh my God. Okay, I see you, Tom. Even though you're a virgin. Your boyfriend Tom wants to take it to the next level. We're gonna wait until the movie's over at least to keep it platonic for a little bit. Oh my gosh, it was a smash hit. It made a billion dollars in the box office. So our bonus was 16 mil. 31 million, thank you very much. It won a Bit Academy Award. We're having such a successful career. This is insane. So as much as I wanna keep going, that was the goal of this, to try and find something she starred in, make it successful, get with Tom, do her music career. So that was the goal. So if you guys try this yourself, I'll have the criteria down below. You can go longer if you want, try to find more roles of hers. I don't even know if some of them are in it. I can't remember if there's a parody of The Greatest Showman. There probably is. It's like one of the biggest movies that came out at the time, but I'm not sure if there was ever a parody for Euphoria or Shake It Up. So that's something I'm not sure of. But I, either way, I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys are also enjoying these longer videos. I'm 
I'm editing them a bit less so you guys can more so focus on the content being played and and made rather than me doing a bunch of edits to try and make it funnier I feel like a lot of you guys are enjoying more so a little less edited but it'd be longer so you can like play it in the background or watch it as you clean and stuff which I do all the time with videos as well so that's pretty cool that that's happening and I'm glad I can help you guys but I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one Thank you.